I know you can't. Something's troubling me. Flotsam's got a garrison. We don't need. What's it to me? A fine mess you have here. Dwarves stealing bread from you. Greetings. Greetings. I see even Flotsam has its ghetto. We're in Temeria, aren't we? Non-humans are to blame for everything. Cattle plague, higher taxes. Let them live, so long as it's far away and not for too long. He said he can't leave it yet. He's going through a difficult time. Pig! Want to play soldiers and squirrels? And this is not care, Morin. I think the stew's ready. Mm. You Nothing might want to stir it. it. I don't stir. I work the material. Want to play soldiers and squirrels? Did you mix the henna with oil? Do I look like an idiot? Monsters! Monsters! Yeah, yeah. Come back after dusk. Moral downfall in the 
You should pray more. It's true. I'll Watch it. Greetings. Who brings you here, White Wolf? Make yourself at home, please. Do we know each other? I've heard or rather read much about you in the letters of the Rivian Diaspora. Well, nice to meet you. Einar Gausel, fundamentally a trader in old curios, although I also concern myself with the non-human community. Books in Flotsam? I wouldn't have thought it a profitable enterprise. Hey! Many foreigners come through here. Sometimes they buy books, sometimes they have tomes to sell. Yesterday, for example, Lady Sheila de Tansevo purchased items for a sum equal to my yearly dealings. Did she buy anything interesting? De Vermis Mysteries, the Exeter Treaties, complete and unabridged, plus a very expensive volume I'd rather not mention. I should add... As generosity must be praised, that she made a donation to the community, specifically to the Fund for Widows and Orphans. The non-humans in Flotsam are organised? We aren't, but we aid each other as best we can. I mainly collect taxes and announce the Commandant's dispositions. That'd make you a prime target for Yorveth. <laughs> You're correct on that account. He's warned me many times, and I've explained the need for my function to him just as many. Both in vain. It seems we've agreed to disagree. Well, the sword is his calling, the pen is mine. Hence, no meeting of the minds. It wasn't always this hard. Turned sour when several elven lassies disappeared. We lost our trust in the humans, and the Scoia'tael ceased trusting us. Did they turn up, the women? No. I believe Necker's killed them. I remember Moral of the White Hands. She and her lover made a beautiful pair. Witcher! Nonsense. Just nonsense. Mind if I... Take your time. No hurry.
at yourself. Hey, boss, look who's graced our smithy. That titan of the art of smithing can't hear us. Busy, works a blur in his hands. And how are you, Witcher? Things working out for you? Nice workshop. Bah, it's no workshop, just a simple forge. But thanks for the compliment, both in my name and the master's. So how can we help you, eh? At your service. So how can we help you, eh? Hello, Geralt. So how can we help you, eh? 